this is Lakeisha from Lakeisha Loves the Plan. Today I'm going to just hop on here really quickly to show you what in the world do I do with my monthly because in my happy planner I use it for my weekly spreads but I do use my monthly for something very specific and what I put here are holidays. Wacky crazy holidays that hardly anybody knows about each month. So in this month, I am going to be recording. I have my computer here on the side and I have it on a site called wincalendar.com. So I will link the, um, the website in the bio below. So please check that out. And I simply just look at all of the wacky holidays and I record them. So you are going to record them with me today. So the month of February starts on a Friday, Friday. And so that's the first. So according to the wind calendar, the first is National Wear Red Day. So I just write it in. And I just um, abbreviate national, oh shoot, I messed up already. I'm just gonna call it red day. Cause I am not going back here. So that's national red day. February 2nd is, you guys know what this day is. It's groundhog day. So that's that and I also know that my church is having us wear jerseys to celebrate the Super Bowl on the second as well. So let's move over to the third. The third is the Super Bowl. Who do you guys want to win this Super Bowl game? You know, my team sucks. Yes, I said it. Diehard Redskins fan I am. I'm from D.C., born and raised. But yes, we are all frustrated with our boys. Um, so that is the Super Bowl. So, of course, I am rooting for the East Coast Patriots. But we'll see what happens because um, the reality is I really don't care. It's not my team. All right. Um, four is World Cancer Day. So the reason why these dates are important too because like World Cancer Day, you may want to donate or um, volunteer on these days because certain organizations do celebrate some of these holidays on an ongoing basis. So like I can see World Cancer Day being celebrated by a numerous organizations and one might be yours. The next holiday is on the 5th. It's the Chinese New Year and National Weather Persons Day. So this is getting a little hard to write in like this. So I think I'm just going to scooch these on out of my Hoppy Pano. Alright, so the fifth is the Chinese. And then, you know what else I like about recording all these holidays? Is that... Um, they're good conversation starters, guys. So if you have a job or just a personal something, the person's day. I had to think about that. Let's stop that. Um, if you have a job that requires you to network, these are great conversation starters. Hey, did you know today is the Chinese New Year and National Weather Person's Day? And they're looking at you like, how the heck do you know that? And then you start telling them about your planning. See how it all works together for the good, okay? All right, 
So that's done. All right. February 6th is National Signing Day. I'm not sure what that means. I'm assuming National Signing Day is for the hard of hearing. But I will find that out because that's very important. And maybe, you know, another thing about these holiday holidays is that, you know, they um, might come with some free courses, you know. All right. Now, this day is the 7th, and there's nothing here. Oh, that works perfectly because I, I got room to write some notes. The 8th, there's nothing here. Okay, the 9th. Guess what day the 9th is, y'all? You will never believe it. It's National Pizza Day. I didn't know that there was a National Pizza Day. But then again, uh, almost all of these I didn't know. Okay. National Pizza Day. So again, you might get some discounts at your local pizza place on February 9th and that would be great for the kids to have pizza for dinner on a Saturday. Alright, let's move to the 10th which is the Grammy Awards and um, I can't wait to see my girl Cardi B, honey. I love her. Money! Mm -mm 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 -mm. Money! I don't bother with these. They don't bother me. And somebody told me that she's going to be performing in Vegas. So comment below if you're going to see Cardi B in Vegas, chat. Because I want to go with you, honey. The 11th is blank. The 12th is Darwin Day. I'm going to write that little small. Because um, Darwin Day. Is that the man who... Came up with the idea of evolution. I don't know. Um, the 13th has like four days. So when I get a day like this that has like a lot of holidays, I just choose the one that I think I'm going to be interested in. So it's the Dice Awards on the 13th, the International Condom Day. <laughs> How fitting for Valentine's Day. Um, Internet Friends Day and World Radio Day. So I think I like the Internet Friends Day. So I'm just going to record that one. Because I have, you are my internet friend. Hello. I have to celebrate that. Maybe I'll do a giveaway or something. Who knows? Stay tuned for the Internet Friends Day. See, a lot of people don't know these days exist. And then we know this is Valentine's Day with the big heart, so I'm not even going to write anything right there. The 15th is blank. The 16th is blank. The 17th is blank. And then the 18th is President's Day. And so I know I'm off this day, so I put this here so I can run my errands and do a list of what I need to do because I am off this day. So, but it's just satisfying to see the word off. So I'm just going to write it really small right there. Um, 19th, nothing. The 20th. The 20th is National Love Your Pet Day. Oh, now I used to have the cutest little dog. We named her Allie Girl. She was a palm chee. And she was very old, y'all. We rescued her. From the pound but then she was really really sick we actually had to take her back to the pound after a couple weeks um, yeah we took her to the vet and they were like they should have never given us that dog because she had so many things going on with her little pet body she was a sweetie pie and we still love her so hey this day is gonna be where I think about Alligero. National Love Your Pet Day. That big. Okay. International Mother Language. Okay, so that's on the 21st. 
I don't know what international mother language is, but I want to write it down because it sounds interesting. I have no idea. Does that mean like how mothers talk to their children? What's an international mother language? If you know about any of these um, not so popular holidays, please comment below and tell me what you know because I don't know about the International Mother Language Day. Now this is a day that I have to get the rest of my Go Wild um, tickets for the planner conference paid. So that's why I put the Go Wild 2019 ticket here. But this is also National Margarita Day. So I'm just going to draw an arrow because that's an important day. I can celebrate that I paid in full my Go Wild account with a margarita child, what? Go right to Chevy's, honey. Get me that margarita, because they're the best Chevy. They're the best margaritas on the planet. And comment below if you like frozen margaritas or not, because I love frozen all day, every day. Okay, so let me know. All right, we're almost done, everyone. We are on the 24th, which is the Academy Awards. Now I have been hearing the buzz about um, if Bill Street could talk with Regina King. So I'm definitely going to see that because if she gets this award, I want to know about it. Um, 25th nothing, 26th nothing. 27th is, oh, the Dominican Republic Independence Day. Now, I do know people who celebrate that because I have some Dominican friends. So I'm just going to write that really small because I don't have room. Not that it's a small holiday. I just don't have any room. Republic Independence Day. That's cool. All right, so I am going to take this layout. Let me zoom out back out. And I'm going to place it back in here. Now, this is also my goal setting part of the month of February. So in the next video, I will show you how I fill that portion out. But I'm going to go ahead and these in here and this is why happy planners are so popular it's so easy to, to manipulate and put my thingy my jiggies back on here and guess what friends I am done with my monthly. So I wanted to show you not only how I decorate my monthly, but also what I use my monthly for. I write really big events here, and I also write the holidays for the month. So until next time, people, I will see you later. Bye, planner friends. Until next time.